Hi guys, welcome back to Queen G's Recipes and today I am going to be showing you how I like to make my homemade vanilla bean ice cream. No ice cream machine necessary. All you need is a handheld mixer to whip up your whipping cream. And the ingredients you'll be needing are very few but very important. So here we have two cups of heavy whipping cream, so about 35% fat. Here I have one can of sweetened condensed milk and I also have some vanilla bean paste. You can substitute that with vanilla, actual vanilla beans, or with uh, vanilla extract will be fine too. But I find that the vanilla paste gives more of an intense flavor. And you also see the vanilla bean specks throughout the ice cream, which is wonderful. So let's move on to the next step. Okay, so also you will be needing a freezer safe container. So definitely you'll need one of those. And that's about it. Okay, so into our mixing bowl, we're going to place our sweetened condensed milk. Okay. Into that, we're going to place our cold whipping cream now we're going to add in our vanilla bean paste if you're using vanilla extract or a vanilla bean you would add it at this point Now we're going to get our handheld mixer ready or um, your standing mixer is totally fine as well with your whisk attachment and then we're going to whip this up to soft peaks. And now we're going to whisk our mixture until soft peaks form and I'll let you know what it looks like when we get there. Okay, so this is the consistency you want your whipped cream mixture at. So now what we're going to do is we're just going to place it into our container and we're going to freeze it. Okay, so make sure when you are uh, whisking up your mixture that you keep your mixer on low speed or else you're going to cause a huge mess in your kitchen and nobody wants that. So um, also make sure that um, it is on the you know the softer side you don't want like too many firm peaks and then have your mixture turn into like a butter mixture so this is the um, consistency that you want your whipped mixture which is going to be your vanilla bean ice cream so into our container we're going to place our mixture can't even tell you guys how good this smells and tastes. Now the only sad part about this is that we're going to have to allow this to freeze for four to six hours or you can make it the night before and leave it in overnight. It will be perfect the next day. Or make it in the morning if you wanna make it for um, dessert after dinner. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna place this into my freezer for about four to six hours and then we will uh, serve. Okay guys, so my ice cream was in the freezer for six hours and I tried taking it out at four hours but it wasn't firm enough yet so I do suggest six hours plus before actually digging into your ice cream. So now we're going to 
scoop our ice cream and we're gonna try it. So definitely the longer you leave it, the better it is. Okay, and now we're going to try our ice cream. Okay guys, so here you have it, our homemade vanilla bean ice cream. I just added some mint leaves for decoration, but definitely I hope you guys give this a try because it is very, very good. So amazing and very simple to make. Now make sure, as I said, you leave it in your freezer for at least six hours or overnight is best. And if you guys would like to see any other variations of ice cream, please let me know in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already so you can see my future videos and take care. Thanks for watching. See you in my next video. Bye.